Building Materials and Technology Promotion Council. BMTPC presents Light Gate Steel Structures. What you see is house made of light gate steel structure LGS. LGS system makes structures made of cold form steel sections, also known as light gate sections or cold rolled steel sections. LGS is one of the technologies which has very high potential for low rise buildings up to G plus 3 story height for mass building under Pradhan Mantri Avas Yojana Urban and Pradhan Mantri Avas Yojana Grameen in different parts of the country, especially in difficult terrain including hilly areas where transportation of heavy materials is a problem. BMTPC is mandated to identify, evaluate and promote emerging construction systems suiting to different geoclimatic conditions of the country which are safe, sustainable, environment friendly and ensure faster delivery of quality houses. Government of India has authorized BMTPC to certify such new systems through performance appraisal certification scheme. 16 such new systems have been evaluated and certified so far which can be broadly classified as engineered formwork systems, precast sandwich panel systems, hot rolled steel and coal form light gauge steel structural systems and precast concrete construction systems. Light gauge steel sections are formed in cold state from galvanized steel sections of thickness usually ranging from 1 mm to 3 mm. Galvanizing of the performed coil provides satisfactory protection against corrosion in extreme environments. It is a well-established technology for residential construction in North America, Australia and Japan and is now gaining ground in India because of its versatility and suitability for range of lighter load-bearing applications. Light gauge steel framing system is a complete drywall system which eliminates wet work. It gives a huge reduction in construction time. LGFS, apart from the new construction, is also suitable for extension of existing building. Light gauge steel framing system is very well suited for high wind zone area as well as high seismic zone area. The system is based on erection of a base structure by assembly of factory made cold formed galvanized light gauge steel sections and subsequently fixing of paneling materials to form walls and floors with and without insulating materials. Once designed, as per relevant Indian IS801 or International Codes BS5950, the required sections of stud, C-sections with knockouts, dimplings, slots, service holes, etc. as vertical members and U-shaped tracks as horizontal members are cold formed in centrally numerical control. CNC automatic pinnacle roll forming machines with production speed of 300 to 450 mh with very high precision. Wall under roof structures is designed using a specialized software namely Pinnacle CAD software. The design data is put into NC file and sent for the production. Once out of the machine, the sections are properly numbered, stacked and transported to the construction site as a package. Foundation for lightweight steel framing are essentially the same as for any form of construction although dead weight applied will be much lower compared to conventional construction of brick masonry and RCC. Hence, heavy foundation may not be required. The light gauge steel frame building is about 60% lighter than the conventional building. Therefore, the foundation required is light. The construction is about 80% faster. The structure has got high and better thermal and sound insulation and disaster resistance. Sequence of construction is foundation length, fixing of tracks, fixing of wall panels with bracings as required, fixing of roof panels, decking sheet, fixing of electrical and plumbing services and finally fixing of walling materials and finishing of roofs with insulation. Profiles are assembled by train team at the construction site in line with architectural plan. Special self-driven tapping screws and fasteners are used for joining different members. Walls are either made fixing in fill-off 
type A cement fiber board confirming to IS1482 in combination with gypsum board confirming to IS2095 part 1 or fixing precast concrete panels and filling with lightweight concrete, mineral wool, rock wool in the gap between the two panels. High density polystyrene core plastered on both sides using wire mesh may also be used. There could be other options for infills also depending upon the requirements. With very high precision of production of the structural sections made of galvanized sheet and other components also of appropriate high grade, the well-designed structure made using this system brings durability and quality in construction. <laughs> ಏನು ತೊಂದರೆ ಇಲ್ಲ ಮತ್ತು ಹೊರಗಡೆ ಸೌಂಡು ಯಾವುದು ಗೊತ್ತಾಗಲ್ಲ ಮಳೆ ಬಂದ್ರೂ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಇಲ್ಲ ನಾಲ್ಕು ವರ್ಷ ಆಯಿತು ಬಂದು ಏನು ತೊಂದರೆ ಇಲ್ಲ ಆರಾಮಾಗಿದ್ದೀವಿ ಮಳೆ ಬಂದರೂ ಏನು ತೊಂದರೆ ಇಲ್ಲ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಬಂದರೂ ಏನೂ ಗೊತ್ತಾಗಲ್ಲ ಒಟ್ಟಲ್ಲಿ ಏನೂ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಇಲ್ಲ ಆರಾಮಾಗಿದೆ ವಿತ್ ಪ್ರೀ ಎಂಜಿನಿಯರ್ಡ್ ಸ್ಟೀಲ್ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ ಫುಲಿ ರೀಸೈಕಲ್ಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಎನ್ವೈರನ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ಲಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಬ್ರಿಂಗ್ ಸ್ಪೀಡ್ ಇನ್ ಕನ್ಸ್ಟ್ರಕ್ಷನ್ ವಿತ್ ಓವರ್ಆಲ್ ಇಕಾನಮಿ ಸ್ಟೀಲ್ ಫ್ರೇಮ್ ಬಿಲ್ಡಿಂಗ್ಸ್ can be constructed very fast to just give you an example uh, to construct 30 houses by using 30 people they can finish it in one week for light gas steel frame house the same 30 houses by 30 people it might take two to three months for the conventional construction CPWD has also adopted this technology and incorporated analysis of rates for LGS in Delhi schedule of rates. BMTPC is striving towards creating an enabling ecosystem to mainstream new construction technologies with the help of CPWD, Bureau of Indian Standards and state governments. Various government departments and state governments are also floating technology neutral tenders to adopt these new systems. It is now for the construction fraternity, especially public and private agencies, to embrace these new systems for achieving housing for all targets and building better and resilient India. With more and more construction agencies getting equipped with the manufacturing capability and developing their trained design and construction teams, the field is open for a healthy competition for the state government and other agencies to adopt this viable technology for their projects.